What's up, guys? It's Chillis John here. I'm about to do air suspension in my boy Jordy's car. He has the same car as me. 2010 TSX. About to clean out his trunk. You guys are gonna like his setup. My setup takes up that whole back part, and then I have my airlines coming out a hole right here. You guys are gonna like his setup better. I'll redo mine soon. Ah! So we got <laughs> We got the whole interior part. We got Jordy sitting down, getting ready to mark up where the tank goes, where he's gonna mount his tank. My tank is completely different. That's his starlight box. All right. Now he's making his custom brackets, marking it up. Gonna have a custom bracket to have the tank mounted to the chassis. Oof. That's one side, and now the other. Whoops. What was that? Drill. I mean, ratchet. First hole in. Pass me a bolt. The rib nuts in. I'm gonna put the second one in. Hey man, you got this. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Mountain holes for the tank. Double press. You tiny? Yeah. Heart almost came out right there. The way he was shaking. <laughs> that tank ain't my boy. Let's now put the this tank up. will bolt right in. Ooh, another bolt in. How you doing this? Oh, I had. It. I'm holding it. Go, go. Go, you go. Please. They bolted on their side. I don't even need to make a bracket no more. To be honest. Just for last, to prevent that. So I can make. What are you I'm tying this one all the way up. Bring a little bracket from down here. Or like a small one from here to here. From where to where? From this hole. To another point in the chest, you should want so the flex can stop from the there to the bottom. All right, we basically bolted up, got the tank all mounted up. Let's see the amount of clearance you got between the seat and the tank. Woo! You got mad clearance, bro. I'm about to be honest with you, John. I'm about to mount those compressors from the back of the seat if they fit. There, you have a lot of space, honestly. You can put it probably like on the bottom, like facing this way. And you do that one going to here and that one going that way. Do like a little setup. Nah, I don't why it doesn't line anymore. That way, stay still. You're gonna make your bracket <laughs> on both sides, right? Obviously. Yeah. And then where are you gonna put the. How are you gonna mount the old track? Still fit. You'd have to mount the water trap first. Mount the water trap first. Yeah, I gotta go. Yeah, yeah. My fault. Mount the water trap first and then put the bracket over it. Yeah, like this. That's it. Yeah, now we're making brackets with it. Well, he's making brackets with it. I'm just here. Giving him ideas. Backyard built. Boys. Backyard built. GoPro recorded. Do you need glasses? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> we'll live. Can you check to see if the door has cracks in it? Wait, it's it's, a, brand just, new it's a brand new blade. No matter. <laughs> He's What's checking wrong? it out. Yeah. And do it because you're slow. You can't. Only one second. The GoPro still recording. The screen just, just turns off uh, so it can save battery. Now I'm talking to Randy before he says something. And uh, said put some gloves on. Oh my gosh. Where my gloves are? Right here, right here. That's how far you need to match it. You bugging. brackets for the tank or oh, white as primer they're coming out okay not that bad and that's the one for the water trap the smaller one right there and then these two are for the tank so Dordy just measured up how he wants his length of the wood. So right there, just trying to mount everything so he can know where everything's going. How you like it so far? It's a headache. It's a headache. <laughs> it is a headache. I'm fixing up his compressor cabling right now. Got the seats back in. Ready to start mocking everything up. Making his center line. Ooh, wow. I suggest you guys mark up everything first. You don't want to mark up anything after and then have it all wonky. So we ran the harness straight through to the other side down there, all the way to the driver door, up into the engine bay. Got the trigger wire as well. Got the ring grounded, got the power ready. We got the first bag in. Oh, I lied, he got the other side too. So if you guys want to see how we ran the airlines, you can click on the video on the top right and we ran it the exact same way. Got everything up and running for Jordy's uh, bags. Connected everything. This is his setup temporarily. All the lines are cluttered. We're going to fix everything up. So everything, basically the two seats are going to go up and you're going to see it just like that. All the bags are holding pressure. He's not uh, losing uh, pressure we aired it out perfectly fine we still have to calibrate it and everything dropping this side down after we just put the wheels on <laughs> nah bro them wheels look crazy Pigeon toe wheel. <laughs> Dude, both his wheels is inward. <laughs> what does his steering wheel look like? 
Oh, that's pretty straight. Calibrating front. <laughs> I know you hype right now. How you feel? And that's all for the video. I hope you guys like, share, and subscribe. Comment any questions you have down below, and I'll see you in the next one.